welcome back to my channel guys. This week we're talking about five of my favorite perfumes that I love and I hope you will too. Stay tuned. My first one here is Victoria's Secret Paris. I really like this one. This is one my dad got me for um, Christmas this past year. And it's just so adorable, first of all. And it smells really good. I don't know really how to exp describe it. I am not gonna describe it anywhere near like fruity or like really sweet smelling. It's kinda got like that, it's got a little bit of a stronger smell, but it's really, really nice. And you don't need too much because it's Victoria's Secret, obviously. And uh, yeah, this is one I would definitely recommend if you're not someone who's into like fruity smells. And most of these that I'm going to talk about are not fruity. So, yeah. This is one I would probably, like, during the winter, probably more than anything. Um, but it's good all year round. So, yeah. My favorite, actually one of my favorite things from Bath & Body, one of my favorite fragrances, it's the Cashmere Glow. I loved it so much. It's, like, my original, like, my all-time year-round favorite fragrance just in anything is the cashmere glow i really really love the way it smells it just kind of makes you to me the cashmere glow kind of makes you feel like royalty and i don't know there's something about it and it's it's sweet but it's like caramel sweet like vanilla caramel really sweet um not too sweet though i mean if you're into sweet but not like super sweet so uh this was definitely one that i loved um i definitely <laughs> One I really, really want from Bath & Body is the for Pretty as a Peach um, perfume. I do not have that one yet, and so I really want to go pick that one up. Um, sometime I didn't see it when I was there, but I'm hoping to buy it sometime. So, um, the bottle is just kind of really, uh, I don't know, it's just, it's kind of just goldish. It's just a, well, it's just a really pretty, like, gold bottle, and I think because it just like it screams royalty to me i don't know why it just does this is one my dad got me uh a couple years ago i think it was two years ago uh at for it's from bath and body is the velvet sugar and i love first off i love this part because i love like the style of the bottle but um, this one is definitely one of their sweeter perfumes. So if you're not too into sweet, it depends on what you like. It's um, it's definitely one you might want to wear like on a on a date or like just a day out um, in the sun. You know, just a fun day out. It smells like really good. So I mean, I'd have to say it's it smells like sugar. Um, with maybe like. Just like just a little bit sweeter than the cashmere glow which is nice um but it depends on what your mood is for the day and so it's just but it's also got that kind of um like it'll it still tones it down after you put it on for some, something about the fragrance it still it's toned down after you put it on which is really really nice so that way you're not super sweet all day long uh one of my very favorites that i kind of like for every day uh it's just the adidas their perfume and the bottle, first off, is adorable. Uh, I'm not really someone who's like into sporty stuff, but when I smelled this, I really, really loved it. And so I think it's really, really good for people who are sporty or if people who just want like a natural like smell. It's, um, it's not too strong, it's not too sweet, it's just right. And especially, I think it's especially good for um, young girls who are just starting out with perfume. Like this will be a good first perfume for some girls. Um, because it's just really simple and elegant or if like um, you're going into adulthood or even going into being a teenager it's a really really good smell all around so I think anybody would enjoy any of these scents. I actually got this one for my birthday from one of my uncles and so I think that's probably why I like it so much. I don't know why he just when he picked it out, he did a really good job because I had been wanting perfume and I don't even think he really knew that um, this, was, this was actually perfect, so yeah. It's the Juicy Couture 
Viva La Juicy and it's just so cute first of all like absolutely adorable and um, even if you get the smaller bottles which is what I ended up with I didn't know how much I wanted this um, I, I had wanted to try it and my mom it was two years ago she was like okay I'm just gonna buy this as an extra and it was like a mini set of this and it came with like a, the actual perfume stuff and then a mini lotion and uh, I cried when I got the gift because I wanted to try it so bad. I'm kind of like sentimental about that type of stuff because she had no idea really how badly I wanted to try it. And as soon as I tried it, I loved it. And then later, um, my grandma got me this for my birthday. So I think it was my birthday. That sounds right. <laughs> anyway, she got it for me as a gift. So yeah. This one definitely has a fresher scent than I would say the Adidas does. Um, it's just a little bit lighter, but at the same time, um, the actual perfume, like the mini like cologne, can be really strong if you put too much of that on. It's just a mini bottle. And um, this, though, is just the regular stuff. So if you're just putting this on, you can put on like three to four squirts. But I would definitely not waste this. This is um, very, very nice stuff. I love this. This is like one of my all-time favorite, all favorites, and it always will be. Um, I don't think I can ever get rid of it. It's just got like, um, not really too tangy, but like, just really clean and kind of like, kind of like royalty is. Because <laughs> it's another one of those ones where you're like, you feel like royalty when you put it on or you feel like a princess. To me, it's like, I feel like a princess when I wear this and I really, really love it and I enjoy it. And um, I would definitely, out of all of them, suggest going to get this one. Make sure you guys try them though first if you can. Try them out and see how you like the scents because that is important and if you are someone like me who loves the stuff at Bath and Body I would definitely recommend getting one of their perfumes and like their actual perfumes because you will not regret it is like you can because it's stronger than the actual like mist spray I know that I said I only had five perfumes to show you guys but I have one more that I want to recommend for you guys to go out and try and please please do because this is one of my all-time favorites i really really honestly wish i had this i don't know where i put it or if we um or if i just ran out but i definitely know i need to get some more and it's kind of funny because it's actually kids perfume i've had it since i was really really young um just this actually is um they're a little it's a little yellow bottle i'll try and tag it below but um i on we don't really have actually we don't even really have any justice places around here anymore but um to me uh it smells like sunshine i don't know why it just does and you know if you've tried the sunshine stuff at um at bath and body then you should know what i'm talking about because it's like that it's just i think it's a teeny bit sweeter and it's one of my absolute favorites in the summertime and uh i still love it as an adult and i still wear it because i love it so much just the smell of it it just makes you feel like summer and so I really really hope you guys will go out and try that one for sure because it is probably one of my all-time favorites that I will always love forever I really really hope you enjoyed this week's video and do not forget there are new videos every single Friday so share with your friends and let them know that I am here and that I share my part of my life with you guys every Friday. These are my interests and I hope you are enjoying them too and that you will go out and try some of the stuff that I show you or that I share with you and yeah so keep your eyes open for some more of me. Please follow me on Twitter. I'm most active on my Twitter. I am I, I check it every day so feel free to tweet me and uh, just let me know what you think about the video put a uh, part of the video up on Instagram to let you guys know like it's coming the next day or so um, but I will always 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 let you know if there's going to be a video or if I'm canceling and deciding not to do a video that week there was one week I chose not to because I was so overloaded I could not get a chance to do it and I apologize for that because I felt really bad and I really really wanted to shoot something it just didn't work out and I'm gonna try and um shoot like two videos a week hopefully if I can come up with ideas and yeah so I hope you enjoyed do not forget to like please 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 like guys subscribe just 
show me some love and I think that's it so yeah guys remember to stay happy always even on your roughest days because believe me I have them too and I know what it is like it is not fun to have that day where you just want to scream and uh, I've had those days myself myself actually sometimes before I start shooting and then it makes me really mad <laughs> anyway be, be happy guys I love you be happy always bye till next week <laughs>